Hi, are you one of those ladies that use tissue paper or water after urinating? Yes, I know you're one of them. Is that you're using water or you're using tissue paper? But before I go into that, I would like to introduce myself. My name is Shugan Banifo. I am an holistic ABBA practitioner. So in today's video, I would like to educate you on how to clean yourself and to prevent infection after urinating. The truth is, when you don't clean up after urinating, you have some droplet of urine stuck in your poo bag, which can transfer to your pants and lead to bacteria that causes infection or vaginal odor. The question is, what have you been using? Water or tissue paper? So I know the answer is water or tissue paper. Growing up, our mothers taught us to use water to clean up our vagina after using the restroom. Did they really teach you the right way to use water? Do you wipe from front to back or from back to front? Wiping from front to back is the right way. If you are doing it from back to front, that means you are doing it the, the your hand gets your anus, which can transfer bacteria from your anus to your vagina. This can lead to a very serious infection. So now, how do you do it the right way? Using water to clean up after urinating is one of the best ways to clean up after urinating. But do you know you have some droplets of water that can be transferred to your pan, which can lead to bacteria that causes infection. So I don't really advise you to use water or use water and dab after urinating. But how do you dab? How do you make sure that part of your body is dry to avoid infection? It's by dapping. So, the question is, what do you use for dapping? You use tissue paper. What is tissue paper made up of? I know if some of you have the question, then the first thing that comes up from your mind is, tissue paper is made from wood. But have you ever thought of it? If tissue paper is made from wood, then why is tissue paper not a brownish color? Wood are brownish in color. One thing you don't know is tissue paper is actually made from wood and mixed with over 100 of chemicals to give it its white color. And most times some tissue paper has some dyes, fragrance and some other chemicals to give it its texture and the color which are toxic to the vagina. Do you know when you use tissue paper on your vagina, you can actually irritate yourself? because of the chemicals tissue paper is bleached with chlorine which are very toxic to the skin tissue paper are dyed with colors which are very toxic to the skin tissue paper has some chemicals that gives it the texture which can irritate the vagina all these chemicals in tissue paper can irritate your vagina the texture of tissue paper can also cause minor cuts in your vagina which can lead to irritation bleeding swelling of the vagina or itching in your vagina so now you see why tissue paper is not the best for you to use after urinating then you must be asking so what is the best way to clean up after urinating if not water or tissue paper can water or tissue paper actually prevent you from those toilet bacteria, like the bacteria you are exposed to from the toilet seat this is where we are going to how do you prevent yourself from those bacteria from your toilet seat? I have the magic. It's something that is very cheap that you can also get from the supermarket. Wow. I got it here. Cotton hoo. Do you know cotton hoo is actually derived from a plant called cotton plant, which originally comes in this texture. And sometimes it is bleached with hydrogen peroxide to give it a more or a brighter whitish color. Then sterilize before packing it for sales. The texture of kotuwu cannot irritate your vagina. It is also sterilized and it is natural. It is very natural. I know you must be thinking, oh, it's bleached with hydrogen peroxide. Have you tried to put hydrogen peroxide on your nails and wonder what will happen to your nails? It will make it whitish in color. Do you know that hydrogen peroxide is also used to whiten your teeth? That is why hydrogen peroxide is used to bleach cotton. I know you must have been wondering if cotton can prevent those bacteria from the toilet seat. No, it can't. But it can prevent moist that can grow on your underwear, which can lead to bacteria infection and prevent irritation or cut while cleaning up so now let's leave cotton aside and let me show you what can prevent bacterial infection from your toilet seat i have this miracle in the bottle which can prevent bacterial infection from your toilet seat 
after urinating. It is called cookies oil. Repeat after me. Cookies oil. This oil is 100% natural. It is a plant-based oil that can help to prevent bacterial infection after urinating. It is made up of 100% natural ingredients which has antifungal, antibacterial, antivirus and anti-inflammatory properties that can help to stop irritation or prevent infection after urinating. It can also help to stop itching, vaginal itching. If you have vaginal itching, use cookies oil. If you're trying to prevent infection, use cookies oil after urinating or before sex. This will help to prevent infection. If you need this product, comment down below. You can also see our WhatsApp details in the description box down below for you to reach us to us on WhatsApp or Instagram or on our Facebook page to order for this cookies oil. Cookies oil is the best way for you to prevent toilet infection. See you in my next video. Bye-bye.